Hey guys, this is a question from Chef Nick. So thank you, Chef Nick, for asking me to do this question. We're looking at a two-step equation that we're looking to solve. So the first thing we wanna do is get the X by itself, which means the only thing I need to do is start with that number that's not touching the X. So I wanna get that plus 10 out of there, which is the inverse is what I have to do. So I have to do the opposite of that, which is to subtract 10. And we do it on that side of the equal sign. We got to do it over here on this side of the equal sign. Now what's going to happen is these tens are going to cancel out over here, as they should. What we're going to have left over here is the 4x. And then over here, we're having negative 26, and we're going to subtract 10 from it. So again, when you're doing a subtraction of a negative number, you're making it more negative. So when we combine those two together, you have a total of negative 36 on this side. Now we want to get the x by itself. This is a multiplication right here, so I have to do the opposite operation on this case, which is to divide. So we're going to divide both sides by 4. That's going to cancel these out, leaving with 1x right here. And then we're going to do negative 36 divided by a positive 4, which our rules of division of positive and a negative means that this is going to be a negative number, and that's going to be a negative 9. Then I want to make sure I go back, double check that, Always go back to the original problem to double check that you have done it correctly by substituting it back in. So I'm going to just substitute it in the top here. Four times our new number that we just said, which was negative nine. We're going to add 10 to it. And we should get negative 26 on the left-hand side when we do this. So four times negative nine is going to be negative 36. And we're going to add 10 to it. And it indeed does make it negative 26 on this side. It's negative 26 on this side, which means I did do it correctly because both sides are balanced out. If you want more questions like these, find them on my YouTube, Instagram, and TikTok at E1Algebra. All these are located in the two-step equations portion on my playlist. And don't forget to like, share, save it, follow me for more, and I'll see you soon.